Hey everyone, this is Leechington, and welcome to my playthrough of Bows and X. I'll go ahead and get started, stay with Neva, and stay on the easier one for now. I just discovered Radeon, I'm super excited, uh, but I'll go ahead and start with the easier level. And this is like an endless runner game through a particle accelerator. And so up in the right hand corner you have uh, your percentage of blue stuff that you collect, and once you hit 100 uh, you go into like overdrive or something. I probably could have actually read the description of the game, but like fuck that. It's a platformer, and I'm, I'm okay at platformers. Uh, the point of my YouTube channel, I guess, is to try and start playing more games and get better at it, because as of right now, I kind of suck, and I want to play more games. Uh, the last game that- holy shit, okay, hold on, we fucking go. I like this color scheme a lot more, by the way. Um, the last game I completed was Mario Galaxy, which was also my first Wii game. And it's super weird once you start playing the Wii, because I've never really played one before. And the controls... the controller is... shit. Holy shit. I forget what to do with my hands, I forget how... what keys to hit. Ugh. So I'm gonna work on getting better at that too. Anyway, Wiimote. Really weird technology, if you think back to like when you first used one, maybe. It's just hard to get used to, so that that took a little while. But I got the hang of it, and I that game was really pretty. I really enjoyed looking at it mostly, not actually playing it because it was really hard. Uh, but I say that, and then now here I am missing it. So maybe I'll play through it again. And maybe I'll put that up, who knows? If I can to actually play through it again. Because it's pretty infuriating. <laughs> and I was a little disappointed at the end, whenever it immediately sets up for Super Mario Galaxy 2. <sighs> but I guess I need to go out and buy that one and play it. And I've heard a lot of good things about Sunshine as well. I don't remember if that came out before or after Galaxy. But I'll probably try and play that as well. As soon as I'm done dying at Bows and X. Um, I'll go to the other. <laughs> but yeah, my, um, when I lived with my parents, we didn't have a Wii or anything. They got one for my little sister like after I moved out. Uh, but for the longest time, I just grew up playing the NES and the Nintendo 64. And I guess we had a PlayStation 2 for a little while, but not very many games. I remember shooting people in Grand Theft Auto and collecting awesome cars with my little sister. That's what we would do. We would just like, take turns shooting people and filling our garage with the best cars. Hands! These hands! Um. Nintendo 64 was the same. We had like a Tiger Woods golf game, I think. And Pokemon Stadium, which is the suckiest of Pokemon games. <laughs> and Mario 64, which I played 500 billion hours of. So I'm fairly good at that only because I played it so much. Maybe I'll play that on here too. That game's really fun. I really like it, even though it is pretty hideous. It was really awesome at the time. No, my mom couldn't even watch me play because it like gave her motion sickness, which was the same feeling that I got while playing Mario Galaxy because of the wonky ass gravity happening all the time. my friend gave it to me with her DS, which is also the only handheld I've ever had. <laughs> it was Pokemon Black, and I never beat it because I got stuck in the desert, and I kept forgetting to, like, 
look up where to go and I couldn't figure it out, so I'm still there. <laughs> In that desert, waiting for myself to come back. Damn it. That was really cool. I like... I guess I should have picked a new level. I'll do it as soon as I die because I'm sure it won't take that long. Okay, Radiant it is! This is my favorite music. I really like this. I don't like the scary electrical strangers of death though. I can do without that. Like shit's not hard enough for me. I know I keep picking these, I keep making it harder on myself. Holy shit, are you freaking kidding me? Damn. I don't even know what I would do if I hit 100%. I'd fucking run into something and die instantly. Ugh, <gasps> oh, shit, that was close to me. That just now, that was a bad idea. That was a bad time. Let's let's try gravitons. Graviton. Oh, this bullshit. I fucking oh I can't do it. It's too hard. Okay. I guess it just like randomizes each time. So that's pretty cool. Or not, it probably actually makes it harder because you can't memorize where to go and what to do. Huh. But it never gets old either. Could have stayed on the blue line and be like, so I'm fucking stupid. I'm an idiot. Ooh. Holy shit. I keep going too early. I get too excited. Oh, Neva, you're doing a good job. Woo, woo. Maybe I should try and play with one of the other characters. I don't think there's any difference, is there? Maybe I should try and be the robot anyway. Just... Okay. Woo! Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. Oh! No! Oh my gosh! That was crazy. <laughs> I'm surprised. I shouldn't say anything about how I'm doing because I'll die instantly. So, yeah. Um, I started trying to play Wind Waker the other day, which was uh, my first Zelda game ever because I also just never had any of those growing up. And it's super hard because I'm used to Mario games. And Mario games are fairly simple and Zelda games are not... not... Sorry, I fucked up. There's so many more things to do in Zelda games. But I do like the story a lot more, and the, it's just an interesting world. And it, it's Wind Waker HD, so it's really pretty. Uh, uh, once again, you have to play it with like the Wii mode. I'm not used to that. And there's like, I. I don't know if I just got the grappling hook, but I just got past the part where you get the grappling hook. I'm not used to that shit. That's crazy. You gotta, like, aim it, and there's the songs you gotta play. You gotta, I maybe memorize them or something. I don't know. Jen's been helping me, because she's really awesome at games. And she's always there when I need her, because she hears me screaming and crying, usually. So, maybe I'll try to get more of that soon. Not doing so good. I'll try one more time. Once more. Hopefully I can do it good enough at one week and maybe I won't need her help constantly and I can beat the game. Oh, shit. I know, it's too much to ask, isn't it? Okay, one more time. Last time. I really like the style that Wind Waker's into. It's so cute. The tiny baby Link, and there's swirls everywhere. And there's 
go around with piggies. Run around. And I like the idea that you can use your sword to like cut down trees and cut grass and stuff. That's pretty cool. So I sort of sad. I sort of wish I had that growing up, and then maybe I wouldn't suck so much now. <laughs> if I had gotten more used to playing games like that where you had more stuff to do. Shit! Alright, well, uh, thanks. That was a fun playthrough. I guess I could- what is this one? This is gonna be something completely different. I'm gonna snuck- okay, let's try this one time. This is... Instant death. It's pretty in there. So it like, it goes up, so it makes it harder. One more for real, one more. Man. Okay, one more. I'm supposed to be okay with that one. I'm supposed to be pretty good. I already forgot that you can just like straight jump. Whoops. Thank you if you uh, watched this far and fucking forgive me for being terrible at everything and I'm I'm sorry but I'm gonna try and get better okay so thanks I'll see you next time <laughs>